Oh my god, Alyssa, that looks so good. You need me to taste? Let me taste this part. Yes. So my sister made a pot roast. And I am tasting it. Get into that, okay? <gasps> yeah. No, that's delicious. More tender. It's melting. This girl is so good. still cleaning and kind of getting myself back together I feel like when you have guests and you're doing things you just kind of throw stuff around and then when they leave you're like oh I need to get back to reality so that's what I'm doing right now I promise I'm not always in a bonnet and a sweatshirt maybe 80% of the time uh, but I figured it would also be a really good time to show you what I purchased from Hope Ulta on Saturday I want to start wearing makeup but not like a crazy amount um, just enough to kind of give myself a little pop you know so I went to Ulta on Saturday and picked up a few items and figured now would be a really cool time to show you what I grabbed so let's do a small Ulta haul okay so first up I have pure a brand called pure it's the pressed mineral makeup powder I wanted to try to give um, this a shot of pressed powder instead of liquid and y'all this is the packaging, and you just snap it open here. It's very light. It's beautiful. Uh, and I love the finish on it, so highly recommend. This was what one of the young ladies at the store told me to grab, and I'm glad she told me to do it. I needed a finishing spray, and so I went with Urban Decay's All Nighter. I've worn it three times so far this weekend, and I have to tell you, this thing works. I'm very pleased. I went with the travel size just in case I didn't like it, but I'll definitely be getting the larger one. I also decided to go with a bronzer by MAC. First, I think I got kind of sucked into the packaging. I just love a good packaging <laughs> uh, moment. But then uh, the finish on this thing has a slight shimmer. You can't really tell, but yeah, you can't really see it. but. It's gorgeous, man. Oh, it's perfect, and it gives you just a subtle amount. Looks like I got a nice sun-kissed tan, so love that. I also got a new brush for my pressed powder. It's like an angled brush. Um, same company, Pure. Figured I might as well just stick with the same brand. So it's doing this trick. I was influenced on TikTok, and they said if you have brown eyes, you should be wearing a brown eyeliner. So I have to say, I've been wearing it all weekend and I actually really like it. So this is by Urban Decay in the color Whiskey. And it's super soft. Uh, it goes on really nicely, very easily. And it gives you that really nice chocolate brown. Love that. Okay. Uh, I also want to try out Juvia's Place. I've never tried their products before, but they are, um, I don't know, I really like this. It's a lip gloss, and it also has menthol in it, so they come on kind of uh, glossy, but they, um, I don't know how to explain it. It has a really nice satiny kind of glossy finish, so it looks like this. like brand spanking news it's taking forever to come up and then I'll show you here on my hands see how it's like a little bit of a gloss to it so yeah look at that it's really pretty um, but just be like a heads up there's menthol in it I didn't know so when I put it on my lips I was like why are my lips tingling like this uh, and then this was the other kind of color that I got this one is called rich honey really pretty Kind of like a peach peachy pink i really like gucci uh flora but did not want to spend 
a ton of money so I picked up a travel size of the Gucci uh, Flora, Flora perfume which I love so I just grabbed that as well I feel like you cannot go wrong with Ruby Woo uh, and so I needed a new one and just picked up a uh, new Ruby Woo which is great to have it's the red that looks good on all the girls okay I also picked up three lip pencils a MAC one and cherry to go with the Ruby Woo uh, what's this one? nutmeg by NYX and a nude beige by NYX so the nude beige looks like this I think you can see oh my god I always said I was never gonna be that girl that holds her hands up but I did it <laughs> I'm understanding why the girls do what they do okay and then this is the nutmeg it's a really pretty brown and I don't know if you guys remember this brand. I say remember because I used to wear them a long time ago uh, but I personally be believe that they have some of the best matte lip glosses and that is Lime Crime uh, and I got it in Fillings it's a deep red so I grabbed that and I think that's it oh honorable mention if you are someone who has trouble putting on lashes for me I can put a lash strip on but I never let the glue for some reason I guess the glue just takes too long for me one of my friends who I went on the cruise with put me on to kiss lash line it's a glue uh, lash glue liner y'all this thing right here is a game changer you literally put it on your eyes as if it were an eyeliner wait maybe a second pop that lash right on and it stays all day if you do not have it you need to do yourself a favor and get it okay Thank you.